Well, I just want to say that, you know, we're here really to celebrate uh, Nelson's legacy. You know, we have um, a diverse and a very creative and economically dynamic city. And that economic dynamism is partly due to the creativity of this city. And this city is so creative because it's a global city. So, and this is really what, what I've tried to capture in this work. This is art. You know, you should support your artists. Um, this is very exciting for me. And I hope you enjoy the work as well. And I'd just like to say a huge thank you to everyone who's been involved in this project. I want to congratulate Yinka uh, for the way he has encapsulated so much history in this work of art. And I hereby declare Nelson's Ship in a Bottle by Yinka Shonibari unveiled. I'm so pleased that uh, Yinka has won this. I think it's an outstanding work of art. And uh, he is an Anglo-Nigerian. It's fitting that all this should happen on the 50th anniversary of, of Nigerian independence. But this work of art is a testament to the dynamism uh, and the exuberance that you produce when you, have a, when you have a syncretism, when you have a fusion between two cultures. This is, this is uh, the view of an Anglo-Nigerian uh, of, of, of what London means to him. And it means a city whose energy and dynamism once conquered the world and now brings the world together in one city. I think this is wonderful. You know, um, the piece itself, you know, the nursing ship in the bottle is an amazing piece. And only an artist, you know, the caliber of Yinka Shonibare, you know, could have conceptualized it and actually brought it into reality. I think it's a wonderful piece and the Guaranteed Trust Bank is very, very delighted, you know, to be part of the sponsorship.